It's Confident Computing number 832. How do I remove malware from Windows 10? Hi everyone, Leo Notenboom here for AskLeo.com. Welcome to this week's video summary of the Confident Computing weekly newsletter. If you're not a subscriber, newsletter.askleo.com and go sign up right now and get Confident Computing in your inbox every week. Our featured story this week is in fact, how do I remove malware from Windows 10? It's not always a simple process depending on the malware. There are several approaches to take, some of which can be quite dramatic. It's one of those scenarios where absolutely prevention is simpler than the cure, but sometimes you need the cure. Also this week, online shopping. Yep, it's that time of year already, although this year's been special. We've been doing more online shopping than ever. As we start to roll into the holiday season where online shopping is probably going to happen even more, the question is just how safe is it? My position, way safer than you think. How do I make sure Windows 10 is up to date? Well, that too has become much easier than it has in versions past. Some would say too easy. I, of course, disagree. And it's also one of those things that I believe is way more important than it's ever been. Finally, sometimes your slow PC isn't your PC's fault at all. Sometimes it's your internet connection. And especially with the multitude of connected devices we have these days, it's easy to overlook some of the other things that can impact the performance of your internet. That's all covered in when your slow internet connection makes your computer look slow. This week on the TEH podcast, as you know by now, I'm stepping away from Facebook for a little while. I mentioned that on last week's episode, and Gary asked after we'd stopped recording if I had seen The Social Dilemma. Many of you have also asked if I'd seen The Social Dilemma and what my thoughts were on the topic. Well, I did watch The Social Dilemma as a little bit of homework after last week's TEH episode, and I do now have opinions. Now, I'm going to suggest that before you listen to the next TEH podcast, you have a look at The Social Dilemma. It's about a 90-minute documentary on Netflix discussing, as you might expect, things like Facebook and Twitter and other social media services and their impact on society, politics, and more. Gary and I absolutely have opinions on this documentary, and it is one that I can recommend watching with the caveat that you really do need to take some things into consideration as you watch the content. So by all means, Plan on watching The Social Dilemma, but then also plan on listening to this week's TEH podcast, The Social Dilemma Dilemma from the Tech Side. That's it for this week. I hope you're having a good week. I hope things are going well for you. As always, if you're not subscribed to this on YouTube, please do hit the subscribe button. It really does help other people find the answers they're looking for as they're searching YouTube. Thanks again, and I will see you again next week. Take care.